Man, what's good with y'all, man? Steph, I'm back with another video, man. Uh, it's been a crazy, I'd say successful week. Um, it really has been. But no matter what, I still got to keep content going. And to any, everybody on the TikTok side, man, I really appreciate y'all for showing me a lot of support and love man even on youtube this week has been really really good i'm trying to get my other channel up but that's not what i'm here to talk about i really want to talk about is just remain positive man really stand on business about that man because uh i'm noticing a lot of people it's just times is rough out here even for myself um, my first job is frustrating. Even at the second one, a lot of people are doing that. And I've been really been looking at the bright side of things. And I tend to do that. And I know it irks people the wrong way. So I like try to distance myself. But I'm just noticing that with a lot of people, even one of my homies, man, well, guy at my job, He's just been having a rough couple months, man. You know, him and his girl back and forth. Got problems. Things happen, man. And it's just a lot of people like that, too. Like, I notice those. I notice it so much. And I always tell people, man, just look at the bright side. You know, look at the positive. It's hard to, bro. I'm telling you, it's very hard to. Because pricing on everything. But I, I didn't do that because I always try to keep my head on swivel, man. Keep my head locked in, laser focused, man. And always just keep praying, man. I don't lose my faith in God, bro. I start to a little bit, but I keep my faith. And I always thank him for that. That's why... This year has been just a crazy great year for me, man. And and it's going to continue to go um, next month, next year, everything. But, guys, really stop focusing on the, the, the dumb stuff. Stop focusing on the nonsense, bro. Like, really try to hammer it in and i'm gonna tell you guys like this you're not always gonna get it right things are not always gonna go your way man and that and that's fine that's fine but always just figure it out not figure it out always try to do the best you can and always tell yourself i'm i'm doing the best i can every day but when you're not doing that and you letting family mess with you, you letting your co-workers mess with your head. And that was kind of trying to get to me, but I was distancing myself from that. Um, some of you guys right now dealing with this messed up woman, bro, who's just blankly disrespecting you, um, talking to another guy. You know, you, you walking away and she trying to come back and you giving her the benefit of doubt and all that stuff, man. Bro, I'm going to tell you right now, man, all that stuff is draining you and, and, and literally taking your life away and, and messing up your vision. And you cannot allow that, bro. Always look at the bright side of things through these trying times. That's why I always tell guys, I don't care about the women, right? Well, I mean, ladies as well, but. I always tell guys, man, always wake up with the mindset of working to get better. How do I how do I get better? How do I improve? How do I always continue to get better, stronger, man? Because that's the only thing that's going to keep you going and i know a lot of people hate that i'm like in a sense optimistic but you got to put the work in every day like if you work in one job and you complaining that your bills are too high bro you got to figure out how to get some extra money 
Like I was telling the homie, man, yo, don't don't complain because your parents kicked you out. Focus on, okay, I'm out. Now I have so much freedom to myself. Let me lock in on two jobs so I can get my own place and have my own freedom to myself. And you start to see that, you know, when you have your freedom, you do whatever you want to do. But he don't do that. He want to drink. He want to work out, drink during the week, hang out, smoke weed and all do all this other stuff and just do the complete same cycle every day. And you know what? Hey, if you want to do that, hey, bro, go ahead. Because, but it's a, it's a destroying, it's a vicious cycle. I'm sorry for stuttering so much. It's a messed up cycle because there's nothing great coming out of that. You're just doing the same thing every day. You're around the same people who just complain, stay the same every day. You know, there's never no, man, great news. I, t I took care of my credit, man. Yeah, I'm doing good. Um, I, I, uh, I gained this much listeners on Spotify, man. That's amazing. I'm writing again. I got these many chapters done with my book, man. That's amazing. But instead you hang around the same people. And I always say it like this too. You are who you hang with. So if you want to whine, cry and complain with your homies, man, and you wonder why life is not going like this for you, it's going like this. It's because of your circle of people, your, your the, the people around you. And I had to learn to distance myself, man, because I like my coworker, but he, he but he just he just don't get it, man. And a lot of people don't get it. That's why I left that one dude alone because it it's a constant crying, it's a constant complaining. And people don't ever step back and say to themselves, you know what, I need to stop crying because there's people out there doing way worse than I am. So I'm in a good position, but people want every, they want the instant gratification, and psh, you keep wanting that instant gratification all you want. You you keep wanting, uh, okay, you keep wanting uh, nonsense. You you want everything now. It's not gonna happen. It takes time. It takes months, years, maybe even a decade. But the fact that you're always getting up and doing it, bro, that's that's the greatest thing ever. But a lot of people don't think like that. They think, okay, work Monday through Friday, smoke weed on the weekend. Instead of trying to figure out how do I maneuver and get around it, I'm they're going to push to the side and just continue to do the same thing. That's not going to do anything for you. But when... You look at the bright side of things and you focus on how do I f solve this problem, life gets better for you. And like I said, you're not going to get it done within that week. It's going to take time, but you're going to say, damn, you know what? I did it. I did it. I did it. I figured it out. Because you know why? I pivot. You know what I'm saying? I pivot. And I still got a lot more to go. I ain't, I ain't complete nothing yet. I'm very proud of what I've done so far, but I ain't complete nothing yet. I'm tired. You you can tell in my voice I'm a little sick a little bit. But still got to work, still got to grind. And you're always going to have those days where you need some time to yourself. That's okay. That's okay. You need a breather. You're only human. Like I said earlier, you're only human. But when you put it off for months years everything else increases but your your happiness your money not increasing bro that's all on you but you have to always continue to work positive mindset without no work does not work it, you gotta have a, you gotta have both you gotta put the work in and you got a positive mindset and let me add this too fellas you gotta attack it Laser lock in every time. Bro, we only got two months left. I was thinking about it while I was at the gym. We only got two months left. Did you do what you want to do or did you just do what other um, brainless people do? But I'm going to tell you right now, I accomplished a lot. Even in my modeling career, bro, I didn't expect to have um, four or five cover magazines. I didn't. I did little 
photo shoots, but I accomplished a lot in magazines. I got I got to um I got to make sure I buy my copies within 2 weeks. Why? Because I focused on modeling while I was working two jobs. I was focused on these YouTube videos while I had two jobs, three jobs right now. Because I didn't focus on a chick. I didn't focus on drinking and partying and smoking. I didn't focus on why my family still disrespected me. I, I focused on waking up every day. Looking at that bright sun. And say to myself, you know what? I still got a lot to go. And you know what? Like my father said, boy, you better get up and do get get up and get to work. Shout out to my pops. He said, boy, you better get up and get to work. Because nobody's going to do it for you. That chick that you like, bro, I'm telling you dudes right now, she, she don't care when you are not doing well for your life. You need to slow down some. You need to stop expecting a woman to help you. Slow down some, G. Calm down, G. Take a breather, G. I'm telling you right now, that woman does not care when you going like this. And there's no, impre no increase. Bye-bye. She going to find something better. Yeah, relax. Relax. Breathe. Be a lone wolf a little bit, G. But how are you going to do that when you still stuck on the same goofy stuff every day? But when you have a positive mindset, you don't have this hatred towards women and stuff. You have a um, you have you have an understanding on women, but you have a positive mindset and in a and a hunger to win in life. Life is beautiful, and then when you do that, then a woman who is a who who wants to be a cooperation to your operator, a beautiful woman who wants to be a cooperation to operation, will want to be there by you. You know, a lot of guys are misogynistic and you know, all this other crap. But, bro, you, 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 you so mad and angry at her, bro. You still mad at your life. That's all on you. Ain't got nothing to do with me. Come on, bro. My everything is up here. Everything is up here. And I'm going to tell you the truth like this. I think negative sometimes. Oh, yeah, Steph TV think negative sometimes. Oh, yeah. But I tell myself, why am I thinking like this? I'm, I'm not increasing my bank account. I'm not getting my skin right. I'm not fixing my credit. So I got to switch so I can fix the credit. So I can so I can uh, um, make more videos. I'm thinking of how do I get more money? Not thinking about a chick. I'm thinking of how do I get more money so I can do the things that I love to do. That's good thinking. I'm not going to be like the dude who's beefing with me. He, This dude got a girl, slept with a thousand chicks in Long Island, but still mad at Stefan the Don. Come on, bro. Let's get, yo, 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 your mindset is weird. That don't make no sense. But you know what does make sense? Making your family proud of you. You know what makes sense? Paying them bills and you feel good about it. You enjoying your rent. You enjoying the fact that you paid your gym membership. I thank God every day I pay for my gym membership. Easy. Because I remember those times I couldn't pay for my gym membership. Oh, can you give me a week? No, nah, no. Nah, here you go. Get a credit. I thank God I can, I can buy this leather coat, man. Shoot, right here. Cause you know why I ain't had it like that back then. Now I do, and I'm and I'm manifesting more. What you manifesting your life, bro? Why are you worried about the bull crap that's on TV instead of worrying about you know what? How do I the life I always want? I'm creating and I'm making it to reality. Come on, man. It's all on you. It's all about that positive mindset, man. I'm out. I didn't expect it to be this long, but I just had to say it.